porn. Welcome back everyone to the channel, and yes, I know, a K-Truck. I never thought something this stupid would bring collectively everyone part of the Savage family this much joy, but before we do that, we have to thank today's sponsor, which is Honey. Honey is the number one shopping tool in America. It's an online shopping tool that searches the internet looking for promo codes and coupons that you could use on some of your favorite websites. Here's the craziest thing about it. It's free. And Honey works on websites you already use on a daily basis. It works on lots of your favorite products like shoes, video games, car parts. It works on those too. Now guys, I've been using Honey for years. And the original reason I got it is the same reason I use it today, which is I've done the entire song and dance of going to buy something and then right before I hit buy, I go on Google and type in promo code for whatever the product is, date and year. You know, I do that whole thing, look for promo codes, waste about 10 minutes, and then eventually I come to the realization this wasn't worth my time. Honey does all that work for me, but it actually gets a result. When there's a coupon, Honey finds discounts of 18% on average. As absurd as this sounds, there is absolutely no reason not to be using Honey. It's free. So with all that being said, folks, check the link in the description down below or just go to joinhoney.com slash savage garage and you can get Honey today and save yourself some money. And now to the damn K truck. <laughs> Are you gonna take it on the road right now? Yes! <laughs> All right. Yeah, windows up! You don't you don't want to be wearing boots with this, by the way. Well, that turns into work. <laughs> this is awesome. It actually cruises right along. So why why did you get this? For my garbage truck. So this is what's gonna take the trash out of everybody. Yeah. And I'm gonna put a plow on the front of it and use it for plowing my snow. Oh my gosh, you're gonna put a plow on it? It's a four by four. It's four by four, they do that, people do that all the time. They do it for small parking lots. This is pretty cool though. Look at this, it actually drives pretty well. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Dude, I'm floored. You're floored? floored? I'm floored. It's so slow. If we don't need to wait for the gates to fully open, we could just fit wherever. You think I can flip it? No. <laughs> We got the oh sh handles! Hold on. Burn out. Ready? Burn out. Oh! 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 That was awesome! <laughs> <laughs> just go for it, boom! That is so cute. Fat guy in a little truck. <laughs> <laughs> that is so cute! What it's do, what it's, it's so it? slow! It's so slow. We were flooring it and I was like, that, that's what's, it. What's the horsepower? Like, I don't know. It's oh, I'm gonna wrap this thing and turn it into like a little savage truck. I wouldn't wrap I'm gonna it. get the, I mean, they make wheels for this thing, you can order wheels. <laughs> And I'm gonna tint that, and we should lower it. Go ahead, you wanna drive? Go ahead. <laughs> now just have a giant hand out in the front, so no one would be like, what's that for? Funk. <laughs> can you reach the pedals in this I one? I can, I can actually reach the pedals, but I just can't see where anything is. We're like looking around. I can kind of reach the pedals, I just gotta scooch. Randy, did you see where the battery is? Jimbo pointed this out. Probably right between the seat. Whatever you do, no. don't get this thing. We can't get in the bed right there. <laughs> it's right here. <laughs> Oh, that's get it wet. Well, so now you know where to put the battery tender on it, Hunter. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Look at this. Hey, go forward. Hit the brakes. Oh, no, we're not going to do that. 
Alright folks, so Randy isn't here right now because he went down to Florida with John Axe to do Ultimate Road Rally in brand new SV. So I'm sure you guys are excited to see content on it, I'm excited to film it. Uh, but right now I want to take a quick look at this Suzuki carry work truck, mini truck thing. Um, just show you some of the things on it because when Randy picked this up it was dark as sin outside. I had no idea that this was a thing and I'm glad it's a thing because it's really cool. When I first heard that this was coming and I keep in mind I didn't know that it was going to be this. Like I, I just figured when I heard a mini truck, Randy bought a mini truck and like many of you when I hear mini truck I think of like an old Nissan hard body, I think of like a Chevy S10, like I think of that kind of mini truck. Um, I didn't think of something that would just fit in my damn pocket. I mean, this thing is so small and it's hilarious. And this thing Randy bought supposedly to move garbage from over there to down there. <laughs> that was the purpose for it. I mean, it's got 12 inch wheels and I don't even know who makes these tires. These are the Garrett G30s and they're a 145-80 R12. So that's a small wheel. It doesn't have that much to it. You've got the bed, which folds out nice and easy. You've got, it comes out this way. It also comes out this way. Makes it easier for loading. If you come over here, Blake, you can see, <laughs> this is one of the first things I noticed when Randy picked it up. The battery's right here. <laughs> just, just right here. Don't get this thing wet. The battery is right there. The terminals are nice and exposed right there. Uh, we also found out, interestingly enough, if you, um, put two larger individuals, larger than me, in the front of this thing, and you're going anything more than about five, 10 miles an hour, and you slam on the brakes, the rear end will come up and it'll do a stop. So that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> you right? Okay. First, and then we go to second. Do you, wait a minute. The speedometer didn't even register. <laughs> Until we went into second gear, it was wait, still in zero. Oh no! Wait, that's just how slow it is. That's how slow we're going. We're in third gear, Blake. Hold on, you ready for this? Now we're in fourth. Oh shit! We are in fourth gear, folks. <laughs> going thirty kilometers an hour. Are you holding up? Okay. <laughs> She's fine. <laughs> This thing only has four gears. Four gears, reverse, and obviously it's got the controls for four-wheel drive and two-wheel drive. Um, you know, but it's kind of incredible. The way they, they geared this, they geared the first, second, and third gear um, incredibly short. We could put around in fourth gear, uh, you know, the quote-unquote the fast gear, mm -hmm. in fourth gear the entire time and almost not need to shift. I mean, like, look, look how... Look how high in the rev range we are. Like, this has no tap, by the way. <laughs> so, we have no idea what it revs to. <laughs> Rachel's still back there, by the way, in case you were wondering. We found out the best thing about this truck. Are you ready for it? Yeah. The turning radius. Like, look how tight of a turn I can make. <laughs> no way. <laughs> oh my god, I got no, it. No, you got it. I got it. <laughs> no way! <laughs> it's the best thing ever. I wonder if the radio works. Have we tried that? Oh, it that? does, yeah. It does? Does it actually, does it do like hot 99.5 or something? We, I can only find it. AM. Oh my gosh, and this is the speaker? Yeah, this is the speaker. That's it? <laughs> oh An nationwide community of local chapters it provides networking and support for people. Okay. We only have AM though. Yeah, we only have AM. No fm. The, the fuel gauge is almost as big as the speedometer. Oh my god, you're right. <laughs> At least you know if it's overheating. Yeah, exactly. There's no question. Oh my god, like we're smaller than the mail truck. You see this thing? We're smaller than that. A bunch of YouTubers have bought these. I wasn't aware of this, but like Hoonigan has one of these things that I think they're swapping a motorcycle engine into. <laughs> um, you know, Rob Ferretti just bought one like five days ago. You know, uh, or at least like that's when the video was uploaded. I mean, it's just, I see the utility. I honestly don't, other than trash and just moving junk, yeah. I don't know what else you do with this. Look how big this freaking truck is! Ah! Ah! If we were any closer to him, the wind would have just knocked us right over. Rachel was like, oh my god! But anyway, I guess my question for you guys would be like, what, what could we do with this? 
You know, like I know that everyone always answers like, oh, you should, you know, do something crazy like motor swap it or before we do that, I mean, let's blow up the engine and transmission that's in it first before we swap something stupid into it. Um, because I'm sure like that is like, I'm sure people have swapped like Hayabusa engines into this or something dumb. Um, but let me know what we could do with this. I, I really don't know. For a work truck, I'm actually kind of surprised at how smooth the suspension is. Because with dualies, um, I know this is nothing close to a dually, but usually like with dualies and work trucks, like the rear ends will be a lot stiffer and they ride much smoother once they have a load in them, but otherwise it's kind of bouncy. This all the way around, it's very smooth. The other thing is um, it's not exactly that heavy. Um, I mean, Hunter did this a couple times and I haven't tried yet, but we're gonna try real time here, folks. You can just lift this thing up from the back, so we've seen. So I'm gonna, is it right, right here that he lifted? Where did he lift it? Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. moved it forward. <laughs> Comment below what you think we should do with this, because as of right now, um, I think it's only destined to go from behind where Blake is standing right now to behind me. Uh, but I'd love to know what you guys think we should do with this. I know other people have done interesting things with this, but it would be kind of fun to do something cool with it, but not take away its practicality. Because at the end of the day, if this actually gets used for the purpose of which Randy said he bought it for, uh, it would probably be in our best interest not to modify it. But either way, that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video on the little K truck here. You know, we'll see where this thing goes. Like I said, comment below and tell us what you think we should do with it, what you'd like to see. But with that, thank you for watching. Check out our merch store. The link is in the description below. We've got a whole bunch of different products on there and we're adding new ones. And I'll see you next time. Take care. Minutes. <laughs> we need to put eyelashes. Oh. Eyelashes. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, or dude. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, sh. The googly eyes that are on the treadmill. Go, go, go! <laughs> oh.